Development is about social change, the things that change our world and how we can change the world ourselves. Development allows you to look at the world critically and understand what is it that you, that you want to accept and what you want to change. And in that sense, the reason why I'm doing this is because I know that I have a very privileged position in society and I'm very grateful for that. But together with that, I need to focus and commit myself to the bettering of this world and I can do so by helping those who are less fortunate than me. Well, for me, when I got into development studies, I didn't really know what it was about. But now I'm doing my honours and it's really opened up my mind to a lot of things, a lot of processes that I didn't know existed in the world, like children's rights and participation and yeah, a whole lot of things. So it's really interesting because I, I feel that I can make a difference. I feel that now I'm equipped to be the change that I want to see in my community through development studies. Um, I've always had a drive to help people. I, when I came into the university, I, I didn't know what development studies was, but I, I knew that I wanted to do something that could change people's lives. And what I've learned from development studies is that I can not necessarily change people's lives, but I can empower people to change their lives. Uh, to me, development studies is about finding solutions to the social ills that obviously exist in our country. And I opted to do development studies because I thought it could help, I thought and I still think that it can help me address the social ills that exist in our country. And through development studies, I know that a lot can be done in order to understand where the social ills come from and how they can be dealt with in the future. Um, I love challenges and um, there's no other way you can face the challenges of the world without doing development studies. Development studies is all about problem solving. My background is sociology, but so in sociology you learn about the theories, but with development studies you can practice what you have learned in sociology and you can help in solving problems, especially some of the migration problems, you have uh, environmental problems, you have um, political problems, health issues. Development studies is all about problem solving. And when we talk about uh, Millennium Development Goals, there's no way you can achieve Millennium Development Goals without development studies. Uh, development studies is one of the best subjects I've ever done in university precisely because it has taught me a lot of things in terms of dealing with different problem-solving skills, races. It has enhanced my capacity to deal with challenges out there because it is through development that one can be able to identify problems and be able to solve those problems. And it has played a major role in my life because it has enabled me to help other people, especially in the community where I come from. So I envisage or like encourage many people to take development studies because it's a good subject. It is the only subject that can make the world better because it deals with the challenges of the, this century and it is through it that we can solve such challenges. All right, um, development studies for me is basically three things. It's um, developing a state, changing a, a country and seeing myself in that change. That's development studies for me. Development studies is an interdisciplinary subject, which means that it is suitable for students who are interested in a range of different issues. If you're interested in economics, history, social sciences, health, geography, anthropology, development studies is a place for you. In your undergraduate degree, you will be looking at a range of different topics, such as gender and development, children, youth and development, sustainable development. As you move into the second and third years, we will equip you with some practical skills, such as how to identify development problems, how to design a development program, how to implement the program, and how to monitor and evaluate whether you're actually meeting your targets and assisting the beneficiaries. It is hoped that by the end of your undergraduate degree, you will either be equipped to become a researcher, an academic, work in government at local or national levels, um, alternatively work in a civil society organisation. Um, many of our students actually go on to work in the private sector in corporate social responsibility programmes. Through development studies, you will have the skills 
to help those around you and those in the wider community.